I've had the Surface Pro X for a little while. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna review it. I mean, it's a cool piece of hardware. Like, I love this design. Like, this is hands down, where's the top one? This is hands down like one of my favorite tablets that I've ever seen in terms of like hardware. But man, ARM is just not ready for Windows. It's just not ready. Like you have to live a very, very specific life. Like you need to live that office life. Like only be using office, only be using that type of stuff because everything else is just really not optimized for it. Like you can't use, is it 32 bit or 64 bit? You can't use 64 bit applications. So when that happens, it starts chugging. You can't use Adobe on this. Like if you wanted to like touch up a photo, that's not possible. You couldn't use, you, you basically have to live in Internet Explorer. You have to live in Office. You have to live in anything that's made for ARM. As soon as you have to load something up and as soon as this laptop has to use an emulator, the performance suffers significantly. And even with all the, the efficiency this la the ARM architecture is supposed to provide, the battery life on this is not as good as some other laptops. Now, I do like the hardware, like having the pen built in, paired with this gorgeous display. Like this feels like it's from the future. This is, I'm sorry, but this is a nicer looking tablet than the iPad. Like from a hardware perspective, this looks nicer than the iPad. But for anyone who's considering this, you really need to know what you're getting yourself into because you might be disappointed. Like you might be really disappointed. If you live the Internet Explorer, Explorer life in an office, you can get by, but there'll be situations where like you have to do something that's outside of that environment, and then that's when you're going to find that frustration. So what I'm hoping is, you know, we'll see a lot more adoption of applications being designed for the ARM architecture. Obviously, I think Apple is going to have the biggest push for this, and hopefully we'll see a lot of that development happen on Windows too, because... I'm sure Microsoft is itching to push to ARM as well and not be so reliant on Intel. So that's why I haven't released a review on this. I don't think I am because it's just going to be a, a really bad negative review.